Hi everyone, welcome back to Liberty Park Music. Today we'll be checking out a technique I like to call the scratch technique. And it's very similar to the chucking technique in the sense where it's a purely rhythmic technique. As usual, if you have any questions about the following video lesson, just reach out to us and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Alright, let's jump right in. So what is the scratch technique? I mentioned earlier that it's a purely rhythmic technique, so here's what it sounds like when I play it with a chord. So it's that, that sound, that scratching sound that I make. So it's very similar to the chucking technique, which is done with a pick. So this is what it sounds like with a pick. So that chucking. So the scratch technique and the chucking techniques they both create rhythmic patterns without any harmonic content. So just like the chucking technique, it's great to use for funk, soul, and R&B music. So something like for funk. Something like for soul. So something for R&B. So it's a very subtle kind of technique. So the first thing that needs to be done to execute this technique is your left hand has to be able to mute the strings. So the left hand. The majority of the control of this technique is in the left hand as the right hand is just going to be constantly moving. So for example, like you gotta mute the strings just by lifting the pressure off the string. So if I do this, for example, on a, uh, let's say D minor chord up here, I'm gonna mute the strings by just releasing the pressure. Yeah, so the whole trick is all in the left hand. Now on the right hand, we're just going to alternate moving between the thumb and three fingers, the index, middle, and ring fingers. First try it beginning with the thumb. So we're just gonna do one E and a, uh, two E and a. Uh. So we're gonna begin with the thumb. So try it with me. One E and a, uh, two E and a, uh, three E and a, uh, four E and a. Uh. Then we're gonna try it with the three fingers first. So. 1 E and a, 2 E and a, 3 E and a, 4 E and a. So as you can see, the technique for the right hand, it's pretty simple. You're just gonna do this while the strings are muted. Um, the important thing is you want to be able to do it both ways, meaning you wanna have the, the you wanna be able to begin with the thumb first, or begin with the three fingers first because depending on the picking pattern, the finger picking pattern, it might change based on the finger picking pattern, like when you're gonna use these three fingers or the thumb to do the, to do the scratch. Thank you for watching. If you wanna check out the full video lesson, please visit libertyparkmusic.com where we have online guitar courses available for streaming 24 seven. Our courses are for beginners all the way to advanced players and we have courses like intro to guitar, jazz guitar, and we have song lessons as well so you can learn your favorite songs. So if you want to try out Liberty Park Music for free for 30 days, sign up with us today.